Fair warning. This game is not for kids. If you're showing this to your kid, what the fuck is wrong with you? What's up, Docs? I'm the Pillbug, and welcome to Honey Pop 2 Double Day. You've seen Mark play the Hello. first Honey Pop game. Honey Pop, sorry. I'm so used to him saying Honey Pop that I guess it kind of rubbed off on me. You've seen DA Games and him play Honeycomb Studio. Maybe even the Cub Scouts if you have taste. I think. I don't know. I usually I usually tend to judge myself harshly when it comes to my taste, so I'm not sure. Don't judge me. But they haven't played this game yet. Probably because they're they're either not interested or it hasn't come to their attention yet. But you know what? I was not feeling the greatest today. I didn't want to exist. I didn't want to get out of bed today. I have like almost 45 minutes before I have to go to work. So you know what? I decided to have a little fun on a tropical paradise because that's literally what this game. I did not know I was still in the options menu. Gender, male, female. It's 2021. Where's the other option? Difficulty average good chat. It's <laughs> no, let's just go with average guy, cause no. Polly's junk. Any Audi? Who's Polly? I, I get what I get the euphemism here, but I don't really get what this option specifically is supposed to insinuate. Is this like a choice between male and female? <laughs> I don't know. You know what? For the sake of making a dick joke, I'm gonna go with an Audi. Select a game icon. Hmm. Does it really matter? <laughs> Fuck it, we're going Lola. Straight into hell we go, and I'm probably gonna get my channel delisted because of this. Honeypot presents. This is a much more dramatic intro than I thought there would it would be for a for a honey pop game. Ancient legends passed down from ages long past. An era of darkness and destruction draws near. This is a honey pop game. Deep within the endless sea of stars stirs an ancient evil forgotten by time. This is a honey pop game. The Nymphogen. Spirits of limitless lechery lying dormant in the cosmos. Awoken only once every 10,000 years. This is a honey pop game! Super period of unspeakable PMS. Wait a minute. There's two of them. With they have tatas. So severe and desire so destructive. Entire galaxies have been consumed by the chaos. Give me a minute. I'm going to wait for her to tell her story before I give my, uh... That only a hero of unparalleled prowess... Before I give my take. ...can overcome the insatiable lust of the demonic pair and return them peacefully to a satisfied slumber. No, never mind. She said it for me. That's the plot of the game. We're literally the learning to double date. Rooms upon an unsuspecting world. So that we can double date no these two. savior has risen to stand against the threat. And Earth is left defenseless against certain doom. Wait... Actually? I might know somebody... Yep. <laughs> All that build up and he's like, I think I might know someone. Man, I really needed that. Oh, I didn't know this was continuing off exactly from the last Honey Pop game. Okay. What? No cuddling? Oh, you're still here? I thought I was done with you. I'm always happy to help a girl in need. I <laughs> Even <laughs> yeah, when I want yeah. to be a douchebag, I, bet you are, you I can't. <sighs> Fuck Listen, off. Listen, I'd love to stick around and watch your dick shrink, but... I got a split. I have a crazy early flight tomorrow. My boss is sending me out to some island for an exotic shoot. Then oh. I'm supposed to meet up with this teleuber chick for a cross promo we've been planning. Ah, <sighs> it's not easy being a world class fashion model, you know. <laughs> I get you. I get you. You think that's hard? Try being a world class pleaser of women. 
Bon voyage! Try not to miss me too much. Weave the panties. I kind of have a thing about collecting panties! <laughs> oh my god. If for any for any of y'all who don't know, just watch someone else play Honey Pop and you'll get all of this. <laughs> bon voyage! Try not to miss me too much. Please, I can barely remember your name half the time. Good. Now. Where did you throw my clothes? Whoa, what the fuck? Ah, there they are. Are you an android? What the hell was that going on with your voice? Well, aren't you at least gonna walk me back to my car? Oh, yes, your majesty. Twould be an honor. Shall I carry your belongings too? Yes, of course. Just let me throw something on real quick. Only if I can get a kiss goodnight. Uh, yeah, yeah, of course. Just let me throw something on real quick. <laughs> Relax, dude. I'm just messing with ya. I didn't even drive it. Later, sweet cheeks. Keep that thing nice and hard for me for when I get back. Okay. Like I said, this game is not well, for good. Oh, well, hi, Q. Well, look at this motherfucker. I leave you alone for a year or two, and you're banging models on the reg? <sighs> I really am a miracle worker. Um, I think you're thinking of someone else, because me and you specifically. We've never met. Q? Holy shit, where have you been? I missed you. Can I perchance interest you in some sloppy sick? Oh, good God. Jesus, no. She's the fourth girl this week. Fuck it, uh, yeah. This week? Boy, it's only Tuesday. Don't you have, like, a job to go to? Yeah, Damn, unfortunately. Son. Looks like I might be right about you after all. Look, I'm gonna cut right to the chase because time isn't exactly on our side here. Some seriously crazy shit is about to pop off and we need your help to stop it. Yeah, it went from helping a lonely guy go on a date to stop to stopping world-destroying deities with a double date system. I I'm just as confused as you are, believe me. I have no idea what you're talking about, but I'll do it! I have a lot of girls to bang this week. You, can, can, you can't find anyone else? As long as there's some other balls I should have tell you, I'm in. Fuck it. Of course it involves your genitalia. <laughs> you think I'd be here if it didn't? To make a long story short, there are these two, like, evil space hookers that are about to be awakened. And if they don't get some wicked good dick, they're probably going to destroy the galaxy. Probably, I think really that's definitely. Because Earth has some of the finest babes in the universe, next to Tendricide. You see, I gotta visit that. My job as a love fairy is to find a worthy hero among all the pathetic virgins. I know it looks like I'm looking down at this, but it, the one, text so is there. You'll have to do instead. I don't know why I always end up reading the text, even even if the person is talking, or if there's voice acting. I don't know. That's just the thing with me. Couldn't find one, so he laughed the two instead. Consider it done. I mean, how hard could it be? I've nailed a space ship before. <laughs> and a goddess. It's an honor to be chosen for the most sacred duty. I'll do my best. I know you're saying important stuff, but Camel Toe is making it very difficult to... Camel Toe? What the fuck is Camel Toe? At, at some point in all these episodes, there's always... <laughs> I always get mush mouth whenever I try to speak fast while recording. There's always inevitably going to be that one thing in any thing, game, video, or whatever I'm doing that makes me have to Google something. What is camel toe? Don't Google that. Okay. It's an honor to be chosen for the most sacred duty. I'll do my best. I'll be honest with you, man. The higher-ups are concerned about your lack of experience with threesomes. Threesomes? But I told him you're a quick learner. Besides, you did bag the fucking goddess of love. That, I said that already. For something, right? Yep. So, put on some goddamn underwear and pack your bags. Our flight leaves first thing in the morning. I called it. I don't know if I said it out loud, but I called it. We're going to that same island that model chick is going to, isn't it? You got it. Give me five minutes. I'll be packed and ready to go. Uh, am I allowed to ask where exactly we're going? Wait, you don't want to sit down and catch up? I haven't seen you in forever. I've never met her. Physically, anyways. Uh, am I allowed to ask where exactly we're going? You let me worry about that. You just worry about looking pretty. 
Mother I'm... Sugar Dust will take care of everything. Can you believe it, man? The old team back together again for another sexy adventure. Back together again, even though I've never met you before. Physically. I can't believe you humans have to get into big machines just to do something as simple as flying. I hate to say it, but if it wasn't for all the honey you guys generate, you'd be pretty useless. Well, we can't call all be <laughs> We can't all be blessed with low bone density, okay? I'll remind you that it's a human that's about to save the galaxy. Are you going to tell me where we're going yet? What about porn? We generate a lot of that too! <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, good point. You guys do make some pretty nasty ass shit. It's true. Anyway, this is some shit I'd rather forget. Fill you in on the plan, huh? Yes, please. We're headed to the beautiful tropical island of Ina de Puna. Why? Why do I feel like that's a euphemism for some? I'm getting to that. You can ask questions when I'm done. Okay, fine. Please, sorry. The Nymphogen, those are the space hookers, are on the verge <coughs> of being awoken by their period. If that happens, you can kiss your sorry ass goodbye. So, you need to wake them up before that. There's a volcano on the island called Mount Nymphojaro. Yeah, I don't know who names this shit. If we can get that volcano to erupt, it should be enough to awaken the Nymphogen early. But, the only way to get that bitch to blow is to offer a sacrifice. A sacrifice of fairy wings. I'm sure you're wondering, what the hell are fairy wings? <coughs> They're on your back. I'm gonna stop asking questions. I didn't ask questions! You're the, you're the one who asked. Whenever a threesome is had, a love fairy gets her wings. Yeah, well, that's actually true. So we need to get you mixed up in some menage a trois. As much hmm. as I'd fucking love to be more involved, unfortunately, love fairies don't count. Fuck. Besides, corporate said I have to stop fucking my clients. Can you believe that shit? <sighs> I can't believe now, look, your voice did that thing again. The, can be tricky. the best way to do it is by going on double dates. Not the lame kind of double date where it's two couples. The cool kind where it's you and two chicks. You'll need some fresh love fairy tech though. That crusty ass honeybee 4.0 is way out of date. So, Just like real Apple products. Or phones in general. The brand new Honeybee 6XL with threesome compatibility detection package. Nice. Go ahead, check it out. When you're done, you can close it by clicking anywhere off the Honeybee. Okay, cool. Why'd you bring nothing but panties? I thought I was the one packing this shit. You can also open and close the honeybee with a simple middle click or tap of the space bar. So, uh, yeah. I I'm doing that that's right now, nothing's happening. My spiel. Well, for now, at least. Any questions? Where does the Nivergy come from and why are they so horny? Aw, oh, did they really say you had to stop banging your clients? <laughs> I just, I just gotta say, I love how they had all this build-up at the beginning <laughs> about these two world-ending goddesses, but at the end of the day, they're just pissed off because of something as simple as a period. I do know that that shit is painful, but it's just like, the co the... The contrasting tones just seem funny to me. I just hit my mic again. You're Where are they horny? The wrong fairy. That kind of intel is way above my pay grade. Do you get paid at all? I thought I heard a familiar voice back here. Hey, stranger. Long time no see. Oh, hi, Lola. No way. Isn't she that tight ass flight attendant you used to bang? Oh man, can I book a flight or what? Go Small for it. World, huh? I never thought I'd bump into you on one of my routes. I swear to God, all these girls are androids uh, at this point. Who are you talking to? Oh yeah, that's right. I'm invisible. You must look like a crazy person back here. Good thing I'm always a crazy person, anyways. Should probably change the subject before it gets any more awkward. Uh, it's good to see you. What do you up to these days? Wow, I. <laughs> I didn't know that that shit was up to standard. Wow. 
I really like your new uniform. <laughs> <laughs> Why, thank you. I designed it myself. I thought the old one could use a little more... less. Believe hmm. it or not, I started my own little fashion design business. I have a website and everything. Oh, cool. It's still young, though, so I don't want to quit my day job just yet. Maybe I should Enough check it out sometime me, soon. Let's talk about you. What brings you out to Ina de Puna? I swear to God, the name of that island is like the, a euphemism for a women's private parts. I thought I'd treat myself to a nice, relaxed vacation. I look, I'm looking to score some of that sweet tropical tang. You wouldn't believe me if I told you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you. Go ahead and keep your dirty secrets. I'm actually going to be enjoying a little time off on the island myself. Hmm. I'm meeting up with an old friend of mine for a little vacay we've been planning forever. Oh, I forget her name. So, what was her name? You want to join the Mile High Club? Uh, Lola Bimbrite, you naughty, naughty girl. <laughs> What's that? What's that? Some kind of rewards program? <laughs> oh, sorry. I read that wrong. What's that? Some kind of rewards program? Mm, something like that. <laughs> I, f I forget her name. She, they rewarding. they were friends in the original Honey Pop. I pretend I have to go to the bathroom. But she was. I'll leave the door unlocked. Wait a couple minutes so you mm. don't raise any suspicion, okay? All right. Bro. Uh, she was she was the milf. Ass. Maybe this chick isn't as uptight as I thought. This is actually a great opportunity for me to teach you about double dates. What do you say? Yeah, good idea. I never had a double date before. Nah, I'm all set. I already know. <laughs> yeah, double date, all please. All right. <clears throat> well, let's head in there. We don't want to keep her waiting, do we? Well, then again, I've never been on a date, period, so... I don't know. What was... I for seriously cannot believe I forgot her name. I've been so busy working, I don't even know how long it's been since I've gotten any. Oh, Alright, okay. I'll try to make this quick, because I know we all just want to get to the good part. <coughs> you remember how dates work, right? Well, double dates are similar, with a few key differences. The mm -hmm. goal is still the same. You want to fill up the affection meter before you run out of moves. You okay. do that by matching three or more of these tokens, either horizontally or vertically. Well, Not diagonally, affection though. Affection tokens, to be exact. Affection tokens are the circular ones with symbols on them. Like those three flirtation tokens over there. Go ahead and match those. You know, the green ones in the middle of the grid there. Okay. Right? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember. I didn't really memorize well, all the of the, the names of all the tokens, except for sexuality. There's two chicks. You gotta learn how to divide your time and attention between both girls. It can be a bit tricky. I can tell. Right now, you're focused on me. To switch over to her, all you gotta do is click on her. Okay, click. Easy sleazy. Now that Easy you're focused sleazy. on her, all the matches you perform will go to her. Hmm. Okay, let's see. I'm trying to find some talent tokens for you to match. Talent. Oh, in the bottom left-hand corner, the blue ones with the music notes on them. Oh yeah, talent. Of course, <clears throat> bigger matches such as four or more in a row will also give you more affection. Switch focus back over to me and I'll show you. You can use right click as a shortcut. Try it. Okay. There's a four of a kind romance token match somewhere on the grid. I'll let you find it. In case you forgot, four of a kind of romance tokens. Are ones with the crescent shapes on them. Aha! Here it is. The thing with bigger matches that you gotta watch out for is that they also cost more stamina. My stamina is Oh yeah, really low there's right a stamina now, so system. So let's find some stamina tokens to match. There, well, there was one in the right top here. Right corner of the grid. Match those stamina tokens. The white pentagon. Damn it. Fucking! Did, I didn't mean to, to click off her dialogue. I was Ooh, trying to. That's better. Ah. The last thing you want to happen is for a girl to run out of stamina. If that happens, she'll be completely exhausted until her stamina fully recovers. Okay, I'm understandable. I sure remember the other token types, but I'll give you a quick refresher just in case. Yes, please. The gold bells are called joy tokens. They give you extra moves. You can't beat that. Yes. The pink cards are called passion tokens. Magic that I remember. Increases a girl's passion. The higher her passion is, 
The more affection she'll give from affection token matches. Okay. Broken hearts work a bit differently on double dates, but you still want to avoid them at all costs. <clears throat> Except for one Matching in particular. Matching broken hearts will instantly drain a girl's stamina and put her in a bad mood. Hmm. That's not even the worst part of it either. You want to know the worst part? What's that? If both girls are angry or exhausted, you're done. Yup, you failed. The date's over. So don't do that, okay? Okay. Aye, aye, Captain. Is that everything? Can I shut up now? No, wait. <laughs> yes. Date Stop. gifts. Duh. How do I always forget about date gifts? I'm <laughs> sure you didn't pack any, so I got you covered. <clears throat> good. Switch focus back over to her, will ya? Okay, good. Thanks, because she was starting to look at me funny for just talking to the air. Here. She might like this one. It's from Honey Corp's newest line of date plushies. As usual, oh, thank God, she'll need some sentiment plushie. before you're able to give her the date gift. Which I one was sentiment? Good sentiment? Is it the... Match. You're looking for the teal-colored teardrops. Okay. I don't see a match here. Well, I mean, I see one, but that requires two moves. I'm pretty sure this requires one. You know what? Uh... Oh, I'm... F f I'm dumb. Oh, God! I <laughs> forgot! Oh, fucking bejeweled logic. I'm sorry. Perfect. That should be enough. You can give her the plushie now. Just drag it over to her. Thank you. There you go. There you go. Honey Corp has tons of new and classic date gifts for sale. So try them all. All right. And that's it. Well, those are most of the basics of double dating anyway. I know it's a lot to take in, but don't worry. Especially because this is where I'm starting. Now finish up this date so we can do what we came here to do. Or rather, who we came here to do. <laughs> well, who I came sure to do, unwillingly. Just try not to screw it up too bad, okay? Don't worry, it'll be fine. Yo, how's it going? Great have work. some of that. All right. Um, have a bit of this. Thank you. Have a bit of sexuality, why don't you? Oh, now I'm paranoid because I never really pay attention when it comes to like other pieces around the board. So what if I fuck up? Oh, like that. That could have been disastrous if it was just one tier to the right, or one column to the right. Ugh. Okay, um... Oh, God, I'm bad at the... Ooh. What will this do? There you go! Okay, okay, okay. Not bad, not bad. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um... Okay, swap. Passion. <laughs> That's dangerously close. Sexuality, please. Um, let's get some moves here. All right. Oh, stamina tokens. I don't know what I'm doing. Fuck. Oh, this. Hmm. God, if only that was one column to the left. Uh. I'm bad at these. I'm still bad at these. Ooh. Oh, hell yeah! Double! Double date! Double match! Fuck it. Oh, God. Risking it for the biscuit. Whew. Okay. Um. Ugh. Is this a good idea? Oh, I hate seeing those things move. Just seeing those damn things move gives me anxiety. All right, Mona, Lola. I, why'd I call you Mona? No, not that. This. Like this. Like that. Like no, no, thank you. No, thank you. Oh, God. Okay. 
I don't think sentiment actually gives you anything, but I don't know. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Okay. Oh, wait, are the passion levels? Oh, yeah, the passion levels are different for both girls. Okay, I gotta pay attention to that. Very much so. Okay. How about if I do. No. Uh, it gives me the same risk if I do either way. Fuck it. Um. This? Hell yeah, increase that passion. Gonna move this over here. Lola, Lola, are you okay with me, like, having conversations with the air? Pretty good, pretty oh, good. Oh, 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 no! Get that far, those things far away from the, me as possible. The purple tokens, I mean. <laughs> okay. Alright. One more, and I should be golden. Yes. Yes! Success! And it didn't run out of moves this time. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's with all the fruit? Well, are we just gonna sit and catch up, or are you gonna take that thing out? All right! Now it's time for the ahem. <clears throat> Bonus round! This uh, is the part where you fug the girls. This is also the part where I censor everything. I have to sit this one out or I'll have to go through abstinence training. Again. Again? But the bonus round is pretty simple. Just forget everything I just taught you about double dates. And match tokens as fast as you can. It so, doesn't matter which ones, just keep, keep matching. This is basically Try not like. To stop or slow down. Getting two girls to climax simultaneously requires some serious dexterity. This this is like those scenes from the from like when you get all hearts in the original Honey Pop. Yes, 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 yes. Please give me oh, the God. bonus. Please, okay. random all right. person all I right. have never met. Let us make sweet love in this uh, airplane it all. with ah. no consequences, like it is an off-brand video uh, on an but, uh, uh, no, Oh no, 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 this is better. Never stop making this is way better. Uh, uh, here in this do this. But that, this dates. is what sex sounds yes, like. Yes, 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 yes. Pennies, 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 pennies. Okay, okay, exit, oh, exit! shit! Was I way too loud? Fuck, I was trying to keep it down. Great work! Guess I, I think you did a good job. Myself. Well, maybe a little better. Yeah, I'm censoring all of that. <laughs> oh, God! Well, that was certainly refreshing. <laughs> certainly was. Hopefully nobody saw us walk out together. Oh, I okay. saw a lot more than that. Perfect timing, too. Looks like we're about to begin our descent. <laughs> I better go take my seat. You still have my number, right? Give me a ring so we can meet up on the island. Is this secretly a fembot story? Uh, thanks By for the, the way, smooch. You're probably wondering why a bunch of fruit popped out of us after the date, huh? Yeah, I am. Well, out here in the tropics, Honey takes a slightly different form than you're used to. Okay. Instead of that weird pink jelly stuff, it manifests as what we call honey seeds. Don't worry, you can still use them to buy gifts and other useful items from the honeybee. Oh, look, there it is. I can see the island. We're almost there. Good, I guess. I can practically taste all that delicious clam already. Oh, God. I guess it's a good thing I'm learning Premiere, because this is good practice for censoring. The melons are juicy and the fish are plenty. And the women are plenty, according to this game. Can you go five minutes without making a sexual innuendo? <laughs> Have you ever visited this island before? Can't wait to get started on those threesomes. I'm pretty sure this is just a twosome. Whoa, relax, champ. We still need to get checked into our hotel. We'll start hunting for hotties first thing tomorrow morning. What the fuck is that? Oh. Hey, look over there. Isn't that your little sex buddy from home? How convenient is that? 
Uh, um, dude, stop much. <laughs> what in the fuck are you doing here? Um, <laughs> what is what? No, me? What the fuck are you doing here? She she told us that. It's kind of hard to explain. I just couldn't stand to be without me, huh? Well, who could blame you? Dude, if you wanted to fly out here with me, all you had to do was ask. If I'd have known you were coming, I wouldn't have had to explain my vibrator to security. Oh my god. I love her. Glad you, you do. in with this chick too. Now all we gotta do is convince her to have a three-way. Um, hey Ashley, can you explain why everyone's voice to jitter like I just explained, like like what I just did just there? I'm convinced that this is like an Android story or a Fembot story at this point. I'm not just some sex toy you can use. I'm sure we can still find a good way for that fight, but oh my god! <laughs> this should not... <laughs> Pardon the strong reaction. It's stuff like this that makes me laugh, okay? That's true. Plenty of holes to fill, right? <laughs> I guess. Bro, where did you find this chick? I want one. I have some business stuff to take care of out here, but I should have plenty of free time too. I'm staying at... What was the name? Oh yeah, Lovely. Lovely Hotel. What a coincidence. That's exactly where we'll be staying too. Huh. Anyway, I should probably go find my luggage. Catch you later, sweet cheeks. Uh, later. Oh man, I am definitely sneaking into her room at night to get a whiff of that. Speaking of which, we okay. should go check in before it gets too late. Come on, let's go. All right. Cool. <laughs> Pretty sweet digs, huh? Pretty if you're sweet try indeed. To the galaxy, you might as well do it in style. True, true. Good evening. Oh. Welcome to Lovely Hotel. My name is Lailani. How may it be of service? Name's Evan. I'm just here to check out a I room. Think oh of no. Of cutie pie could be of service to me. <laughs> uh, just check it in, thanks. What kind of services do you offer exactly? Uh, just checking in, thank you. Oh, you are? Okay, uh, perhaps I need to double check. But I don't remember seeing any more reservations in the system for tonight. Shit! I uh, I forgot to do something. Does that uh, mean we have to problem, bribe though. at the date? I'm sure we can find the appropriate accommodations for you. What kind of room are you looking for? I'll take any room you have that's available. Give me the most expensive and luxurious room you've got. Maybe you and I can share a room together? <laughs> uh, I don't I don't care if me set reading these options out like that is annoying. It's funny. Not the way I'm reacting, but the the the, the, the options themselves. Fuck it. Oh, uh, that would be the royal suite. I'm afraid that room isn't available tonight. Yeah, but I do have a great room for you on the second floor. It has a nice view and a big bed. I Perfect. think you'll find it to be quite suitable. Excuse me briefly while I retrieve your key card. Thank you. Okay, you're all set. Here's your key card. The room number is written on the back. Thank you. If you need anything else, please don't hesitate to ask. That's what we're here for. Of course. I think I'm good for now. Thanks, Lani. Can you have a look? She's a tissue set up in my room. A massage would be. <laughs> Can you have lotion and tissues sent up to my room? Oh, uh, you'll find plenty of complimentary lotion and tissues in your bathroom. Perfect. Our guests seem to go through an awful lot of them. I wonder the why. The behind you to your right. Enjoy your stay and have a wonderful night. Thank you. I'm sure as hell gonna try. Morning, sunshine. Morning. Hope you slept well, because we've got a full day of double dates ahead of us. You remember how the honeybee registers the girls you meet and tracks their location, right? Yep, well, unfortunately. Well, it can also detect the presence of girls that you haven't even met yet. 
A lot of them seem to be from Honeycamp Studio. And select a location where <laughs> two girls are gonna be. The <clears throat> honeybee will automatically detect if the girls are compatible with each other. Of course. If they are, you can probably coax them into a threesome. But hmm. it might take a date or two. Or three. Or five. Well, four anyways. Oh, do I actually have to choose? Lalani or her? Ashley or I assume the goth chick? Goth chick! Alright! I'm psyched! You psyched? Yeah, you're psyched! Let's Damn go right I'm psyched! Oh, oh, I forgot. And if you ever need to check in with me, just meet me back here at the hotel room. God damn it, with the voice thing again. Is this like an actual bug in the game? Is this like my computer? I don't know what's going on. Oh, hey. Came to see me off, huh? How sweet. You're a real Romeo. Wish I could have stayed longer, no, but Dewey calls. See you when I see ya. See ya. <laughs> so, what about the other girl? Nah, I'm just fucking with ya. I'm actually waiting for my little cousin to arrive. Cousin? When my aunt heard I was going to be out of town for a while, she begged me to take her off her hands. <laughs> I figured... Knowing sure, her character? I, can, sure I can't... I can't... I can't imagine break. why. My cousin can be... Uh, Goth. A handful. Goth. Speak of the devil. There she is. Hey, Lil! Over here! Good to see you, cuz. How was the fight? Of course. Um, like, literally the worst experience of my entire fucking life? I think I know Say who she's supposed to replace. Lighten up a little. You're in a tropical paradise. Whatever. I didn't ask to come here. My mom forced me to come because she fucking hates me. I can't imagine why. <laughs> Lillian, your mom does not hate you. I wish the plane would have crashed. Maybe then she'd finally be happy. Right, oh god, what are the f Okay, this is turning down. up to 11 It'll here. You'll see. She's not hiding her fembot nature. Is there a around here? I got pee. Hey, sweet cheeks, entertain my cousin for a minute, will ya? I'll be right back. Gladly. I regret making this choice. Okay. Now we're stuck babysitting Count Snatula. Didn't the goth thing go out of style, like, six million years ago? I don't know, man. The, the, the dark priestess here is looking a little fresh, if you know what I mean. Okay, you okay, try to yeah, find out cool. how old she is. <laughs> what are these... So Ashley's the older one? <laughs> God damn it. Well, I guess that one's the less creepy one, but they're all still pretty fucking creepy. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> weird, I guess, is the proper term. But I don't know. So Ashley's the older one, huh? By how much? <laughs> how am I supposed to know? You don't need to babysit me, okay? I'm not a fucking kid. I'm 18. Phew. We're all clear for the takeoff. Okay, oh, this is definitely a glitch. So boring. What is there even to do at this place? Sex, I think. You're on vacation. Kick back and relax. You can go swimming or sailing or shopping. There's tons to do. You can always just order porn from your hotel room. <laughs> yeah, you can always do that. Uh, what? Who the fuck would pay for porn? Yeah, no thanks. Maybe but that's where the luxury I shit happens. And let a bunch of guys have their way with me. Do you think my parents would like that? <laughs> yeah, that'll show them. Your parents hate threes most of all. That doesn't seem like a very wise idea. I mean, she's not, he's not wrong, but I don't think she cares. I hear parents. Hate threesomes most of all. Nice. Uh, looks like Ash is finally done. That only took my entire life. I call next dibs. I've been holding it for like 30 minutes. 30 minutes, that's it. Okay, I'm back. Sorry for the wait. I hope she wasn't too much of a hassle for you. Uh, yeah, she's just kind of stood there. Now? I'm hungry. In a minute, Lil. They haven't even started returning people's luggage yet. <sighs> Please kill me. 
I would, but that would negate the entire plot of this entire game. Compatibility detected! And also, I detected a, f a way to end this episode here. My god. That was a lot. A lot more than I intended because it's like 3 p.m. and I gotta go get ready for work. I never know what I'm doing when it comes to this shit, so who knows? Maybe I'll continue it, maybe I'll tie it in with all the other series I'm supposed to be doing, and we'll see what happens. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, hit the like button down below, and I'll see you in the next episode of Whatever the Act I Make. Ciao! There was a censorship option?